all right coming in the next video maybe i did a little poor job right now uh recognizing exact location of where what these little stores were because the whole thing was just it was a construction that took place in that area and again i have to go there concentrate myself look at that thing to get an idea what exactly took place so i can point out exactly okay but a bottom line fact in this video is that you can realize that i did recognize the name of the store the name of the store is troll i recognized the owner i got the information they know me and that's how i got basically that information a little background um the name troll why the name troll in that store why i came to that store i came to that store after i finished the host gears uh let's just say downtown's gears and then i was on my way back to this place grotniki so pretty much walked all day long and on the way back since the store was still open i said why not let me go and stop here i've seen this before troll i thought about it and he came to me all the information about um the gentleman worked on location in area where i pointed out then he opened this store the name of the troll of the store he got because of the americans uh, and then they trolled me around with this issue and have told me that the name of the store is going to be after me that i am troll basically and at the time it was a little bit unpleasant um, but it seems like gentleman was so excited and i'm so grateful to him that he went ahead and he registered the trademark troll he was the one the gentleman i have spoken to um this is not even information that is revealed in my con i should say in our conversation with a sales lady with him uh, but pretty much everybody knows me in Zgersh. And so, yeah, he had a company he opened, just a brand, for a very short period of time, the name was Troll. And it was like just for a very, very short period of time. Again, this is not included in conversation, but this is again, this is a data I'm giving you. And this company, clothing company, was then changed into a company known as Top Secret stop secret as the lady tells was the one that have you want to call it, destroyed troll or eaten the troll up or whatever it is uh this is the name of the new brand that uh german opened afterwards i think he was the one who opened uh, i don't know how they did this maybe they did something in respect to that stuff too to avoid legal issues or whatever but uh this should be saved for the last video for the last part of this what i'm gonna go next to and i'm a little bit afraid because this is like a lot a lot a lot of stuff i have done and i have to go over all those recordings about businesses owners and so on um and i'm a little bit afraid to go with this android with all these issues here to get into that kind of stuff it's going to take a lot of time shoes are cut everything is not in a good order meaning you know, um, i wouldn't go too far with these complaints okay but it's really not a very easy situation meaning that i'm gonna have to just get the job on tuesday something to work buy myself a computer um so i can really do the job like this because i'm not going to be doing playing with this um, tablet back and forth electricity issues internet issues and i don't know what kind of crazy issues it doesn't work like this um the sooner the people of Zgersh lodge would come forward with this stuff 
the sooner I would get rid of literally of the hunger. It's Easter, but today I'm gonna be hungry. It's, this is true. This is just a fact. It's not such an easy situation. Um, here is the recording. Yes, I did recognize individual. Um, the store when the store was open, uh, and I pointed out him where his previous store was, and so on. The lady is still the same. What's also interesting, the lady that comes to the store, I want to say her thank you too, also was the same friend. Uh, let me give some background about her. Deliveries for the store that she is doing. Yeah, she's been doing this already for this particular store already for several years. Uh, not new to this store is an old friend of the lady that she have spoken to and so on and so forth okay so now you decide whether I'm guessing this stuff or is it really a factual stuff I'm talking about I don't think you can just go in, in, in a store and uh, you know get this kind of information and you remember this kind of information day of the opening of the store uh, where the gentleman, the store owner, worked before, where he had the store before, or whatever. Um, I know how long this troll company was open. I point out, I think I, I do, that it was open short time, and he agrees with me with everything, just as a sales lady does. Okay, so let's go to um, an interview. Again, this is very well done. Um, if I have to go to that place, which I'm going to go. Look, there are some people I know. They have another store in vicinity. I'm just, I just want you to get ready because I'm going to stop by. Um, where you took your first vacations and so on and so on and so <sighs> forth. So there is a whole a lot of stuff and a lot of desperation in this room too. Let's go on. Okay, there you have it. We go on with MK Ultra. Uh, this exactly is the store, right? Uh, the store that you see right here, I have identified after I have done downtown. I call this like a down. I think it's like a downtown's gearsh, I would say. Uh, this is already when you go back to. Uh, to our center it's about two hours walk from here I would say and on the map this thing would look like this uh, I should just see this instead go here I try to this like this 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 is what it looks on the map like now we're gonna zoom out a little bit a little bit more there you have it okay so this is where this thing is located and what i have done so far would be about this area here and um, then it would be this area here the whole thing i'm talking about the whole thing actually all the way here like this and then it would go like this down ta -dum, ta -dum, like this all this here basically this is what's gonna be that i have to present but this is the stuff it's a lot it's a lot of stuff uh, best would be done by computer i think because it should be explained why I have felt in about certain situations as I did. Um, I sure did some mistakes, but quite some mistakes. But I rationalize without any doubt. It's not going to be a difficult thing to prove that my witnessing is factual and it's not some sort of, you know, something that you would just twist out of, um, you know. Terta, we say in Slovenia. Um, so that's that. Now let's go see video. Uh, definitely use this as MK Ultra proof. I want to thank gentlemen and of course everyone else. 
That's pretty brutal. Now well, let's see what's gonna happen. Um, as soon as I have activated, look at that. As soon as I have activated the recorder, you see the recorder, automatically the recorder restarted the, uh, the Bluetooth option. Have you seen this thing here? And so what we're going to do, we're going to stop one. Very, very, very crucial evidence about what's going on. This screen, this tablet, this Android is modified in a such a way that it's transmitting the whole thing through the Bluetooth. Either Bluetooth or Wi-Fi. So whatever I do, they've people are pretty much uh, updated with absolutely everything I do. And I guarantee you there are cameras in here. Uh, let's continue with the business. <clears throat> that was a beautiful one, by the way. What they have created out of this thing is amazing. I am not so sure any longer as well about whether the internet speed, Wi-Fi is really so slow because I realized that what is depicted to me what is depicted to me on a yeah what is depicted to me as a internet meter differs greatly from what I have managed to record from the internet online speed meters uh, so that stuff is also very, very questionable. Uh, they might have modified that stuff as well. Um, or might have been that the settings are changed or something like this. Very difficult to know. Uh, this is yet the stuff I have video recording. It's got to go to the police. It's got to go to the people so they can inspect this properly. No, it's like this. It sits right there 20 minutes as well as mine. I'm going to let it go 20 minutes. This is a such an important MK Ultra proof um, that I'm just going to take time to go over. I was inside, waiting inside to get this proof done properly, waiting for the gentleman to actually come and then talk to him after I have spoken with the sales lady. Uh, also note the reminder that in this very room with me is a gentleman from Belarus who was present in MK Ultra and is very well acquainted with situation. You're going to hear some banging with the doors. Uh, you could say that the Russian control which was dominated throughout MK Ultra, uh, it was like they hold the whole thing in hands like a joke. The whole thing is basically still goes on under the same environment, the same thing. Um, maybe that's important to mention. <clears throat> so now let's continue. Oh, I said hello to the lady. Go around. I start the conversation with her. Thanks, the guy. Okay, so the first thing I do is identify the store and I already tell her she's alone inside of the store that the owner of the store is in fact a male, it's a pun. Now how do I remember I already have explained? Uh, 
I asked her about the day of the opening of the store. I thought it was open in 2012-2013. She gives me a green light about that too. I go to the name Troll. Now this is where it's tricky because she knows who I am. She knows I know the whole thing. And I, I joke about the name Troll with her. I ask, I ask if um, the troll, um, I don't hear very well here, but uh, it's going to be, može, proše. Um, okay. And so it's going to be um, a lot about, a lot of joking here, but this is what I like anyways. She's looking at strange. I want to present myself in Slovenia. My name is Sebastian. Back then, I was known as Bob. Okay, the thing is that I know everything and about her and about everything. Um, I ask about the troll. Um, how long did did it did it stay that the brand and so on? And she said it's finished. It was replaced by the top secret. And this is where I should end the trip that I have indicated to you. All this zgirsh, all these stores that I have gone through right in this store. But you know I'm gonna get to that. Uh, I just want to give you something for the weekend so you can chew on uh, understand this thing is real uh, it's damn real it's it's real as it can possibly be real what you're seeing I know it could be like this but it, it's more than real it's very very real uh, I'm not a troll but really the name of the store was really given by owner after me he registered his trademark as a clothing trademark for a very short period of time then he quickly changed it and that was like a really really short period of time secret destroyed troll. The top secret is what is going on with this case, if you didn't realize, in case you did not realize. This is when the whole city knows about you, this is when the whole country knows about you, but really nobody knows you. And they know you in the US, and the politicians know you in Germany, and in France, and in Britain, and everywhere, but nobody knows anything about you. Because everybody is afraid to say anything. So. Okay, the lady comes, long time friend here. Um, it might be she is already friend here in this store, in this business. Definitely friend, I don't know how long. Supplying this store, in my opinion, for at least, I'm going to say at least... Um, I shouldn't maybe say that, but she was an MKI tribe, I should say. That's why I'm saying that a long time know each other. 
She delivers packages for the store, and really, I'm gonna load the whole the whole thing all through because you know there's a lot of stuff I did about watch, but I kind of feel stupid about it. I didn't go the inside, the background, why I have recognized the stores and stuff like that. How and so on. That was such a quickie, and in this case, I have a tremendous problem because you know I wish I had an Android. I did, I wish I had something I could attach and. And when you go inside of these businesses, when you do this stuff, it will be presentable. But I have nothing. I cannot point out the photos inside of this, how it was, what I have identified, how I have identified, and so on. Or certain things, why I have made a mistake, how they made me made a mistake, and so on. It's too damn bad. But such important historical stuff for you. I'm just being quiet as a mouse because I don't want to interrupt. Um, I know there is more to find out. I want to meet owner about a little bit about the owner. This is. In fact, a very nice gentleman, a really nice gentleman, um, he did troll me a little bit under MK Ultra, but that's okay, I deserved it, I'm not denying, I'm not disputing stuff, um, and he did so with the good intentions. I'm going to pause this a little bit because the audio recording here really is bad and, and I did amplify one for like three decibels but it doesn't, it doesn't sound right, I changed this thing back. Now you have also seen how the device itself is Bluetooth controlled, how these things are done, why the application just fell down like this, just snapped down. So this is original audio recording, nothing here changed. Uh, the lady is inside of that store and she's gonna remain inside of that store till the owner is gonna come that's when about in about I'm gonna tell you <clears throat> I think I estimate like in about six minutes from here it's gonna start it's gonna develop into important stuff I would ask the other lady about the stuff but there's really what what am I gonna ask her for you know, Another thing is, you know, another thing is with this packaging companies, uh, deliveries and stuff like this. If I would say that she's working, supplying the shop for four years already, which I'm pretty certain that she does, at least, and it's probably another two years to that, you can go like six years. It could be and it could not be. It would destroy the main evidence. It's basically recognizing that the owner is a gentleman, that he had a store next door, that um, the store was open sometimes in 2012 and so on. A little background. In this area, there were like, I think like three clothing stores, something like this. And when we would go from Grotniki to 
from Grotniki to Zgirsh, we would pass by here and it would be Americans that would troll with this Polish people around, joke and yeah, most of these American people are really, really decent people that did actually had on their mind me and were eager to help me out somehow and um, you know, I don't know how he got the idea to do this stuff, but I was told that that he's going to do something like this, that he's going to go and register them and stuff like that, so I can recognize the store, so... He can give an idea about the top secret. About basically what this case is all about. Polish people like these Americans because they were, these are cosmopoli cosmopolitans, they, these people were everywhere around the world with these politicians, they traveled around, they seen the world, they pretty much see the world from the business perspective, they gave good ideas, good tips to the shop owners future shop owners in some cases, people that open stores, the women around. The two are just talking with one another and I'm browsing shirts. That's all I do. They have a really quality stuff in that store. Very beautiful uh, clothing. A really quality clothing, I like it. Very fashionable, nice. I would recommend for you to go inside of that store. Uh, it's going to cost you maybe a little bit more, but I still think it's a normal price at good cost. High quality at good cost, I would say. This proofs are not easy to get. Um, I don't know about you, I don't know how much you remember about your own town, whatever it is that you are, when the stores were open. Now think about sirens, there you go. Now think about being drugged up, let's say. Let's say being drugged up and walked all over the city and brought back to the certain city not your city but city in another country where you don't even speak language on another continent brought back to that city for no less than 20 years and city changes and businesses change People change, businesses inside, in some cases, are remodeled. You are located two hours away from this city, and your task is, beside having been in an environment as I am, to go to that city and identify all the businesses. Of course, you have to take into account that two years prior to this, the whole thing that you have memorized whatever is left, whatever did not change and so on will be screwed up by somebody and somebody's gonna go out and they're gonna set fake stores they're gonna tell you all kinds of lies, stories which however will surface first in your memory during procedure itself you're gonna be exposed to electric convulsive transmission ECP Think about how that will affect your memory. <laughs> My uh, better resume is just twisting around right now on the bed, I know. There was an ECT, electroconvulsive transmission, that was done in 2017 inside of this immigration center. Individual who had done one was from Moscow. It was not 
either of the two individuals that are here inside of the center now whether these two knew or not I do not know but they did have a portable ECP machine with them covered me with the shit over my head uh, these bunks are really really wide here it was a common practice for MKUltra staff members to stay with me in a bunk and give you different kind of brainwash whatever in the evenings and so on they were doing whatever they were doing I would be just next to them like that basically were and the dude the Muscovich pulled this thing over my head and the only thing I remember I was fed up I didn't like any of this stuff anyways just something you have to be patient and this and that and it was aha the owner comes they talk and then back to the store again and so on and so forth and your memory is very screwed up like this I was told actually that I'm going to be rated according to my memory uh, how the memory will be uh, I can tell you that memory is perfect uh, whatever Russians didn't do the stuff uh, it did not have any mistakes uh, I'm not going to be paid according to my memory I'm going to be paid according to what you have screwed up with my memory according to what you have used the ECT and other methods to wipe my memory this is the stuff that is more of my concern than what I have managed to recall here or not you screwed yourself up big time with what you did you screwed yourself even more than what you already have screwed yourself in the top of that This is what Germans dream something about it. This is how I'm going to be compensated. This is a big mistake. If I would know what I'm talking about, that would be something completely different. But recognizing people and so on, um, you know, it's a whole different situation in that case. Using violence, violent methods such as electroconvulsive transmission, this is not a reward. This is not going to go in your pocket. This is just really, really misfortune for you what you have done. We'll get to that. I'm going to dedicate video when I go to that stuff in 2017. What happens when I go before I go identifies Gersh? Will explain in detail what happened. Executed me with that portable machine like you wouldn't believe it was just pain and dark and then you would come back you would be like it's okay now is it end is it over I actually had to give him a verbal okay that I'm gonna be quiet when he's gonna be doing the stuff like this under MK Ultra. There is the owner. No longer uh, exists, troll. 
Yeah, I identified the shop he had before, right next to the store. He says yes. We are joking, they know me, these people know me. Uh, I don't even hear what they are, what we are saying. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put the original recording. I thank you gentlemen very much and I also ask him if he's got some more. Of course, if I am open, bye bye, thank you very much. And that's that. I go out on the streets, I do a little video that you already have seen, that's about it. For this video, in this vicinity there was a construction. They have removed some of this little. Um, stores they have changed it and i guess it's going to be my job to go there and look that thing again and think about what they have changed try to recall what what was different before and so on this is the kind of stuff i do this is not just like you go and you just pull something just just like this easy this is not an easy stuff uh, this is a brutal stuff actually this i would rather go and do a workout much rather than uh, stuff like this okay that's why I wanted you to be a little bit patient with me to go over this recording uh, so you can hear the whole thing exactly how it happens it's nothing fake or anything about it yep yep uh, not a good news for the Ruskis uh, that was a pretty damn bad idea what you have done here in 2017 uh, and it's not that you wouldn't try to do dirty stuff in 2015 but the most important one was for you in 2017. Um, definitely not a form of help from Belarus. I'm not going to go about whether these two that are here now, whether they knew about this or they did not know about this. Uh, it really doesn't make me any difference, okay? What makes it, dif what makes it different, what's important is that this is how the case is seen the case is seen as it was uh, thanks for watching this video uh, till next time okay we're gonna use this here for the rest of the day for the end uh, i hope you can see it the name is troll this is just a tiny little shop like the one you see it here okay like the one you see it here and there was more shops like this and this gentleman I do not know whether he used to work in one he definitely did work in one he was a salesman definitely but probably he might have also been owner uh, you might have realized that it pointed out the year of opening of this store I recognize the owner I recognize the store I recognize the troll brand. The lady is still the same. Um, 
and there is a little story behind I will tell you about okay